Well, hey guys, I'm back, and look what I got. It is the Going Gear EDC Club, freshly arrived here for August 2021. Can't wait to see what's inside. Um, I brought a knife out with me to open it, but I forgot, we don't need one. So I'm really enjoying the EDC Club. It's, it's a different mindset from some of the other boxes, and it's some cool stuff. And, oh, we got a little tiny sticker this time. Look at a little round sticker. How cute. How cute. Um, oh, we got something by Best Tech. And we got, this is a little pen, maybe. And, um, all right, so I'm not sure what some of this stuff is. What is this? Spray on, rub in, wipe off. Well, that just sounds naughty. But let's see what we've got from the EDC Club. And remembering that what's cool about this subscription is that it is not tactical, tactical, you know, survival. It's just EDC. So, um, for about $50, give or take, and then some shipping, we get all of this stuff. Um, let's see. So, we've got one, two, three, four things in the box this month. I, you know, I I should go in order, but I'm just, I'm so curious to see what's in this little box here. So this is the Falamov EDC C1. Oh, it's a little light. Look at this guy. Reminds me almost of a Rovivon kind of thing. Um, 400 lumens for 30 minutes, micro USB rechargeable. Got a 10440 battery and an aluminum storage case. So what's cool is, you know, if you choose to take the light out of the storage case, you now have a little aluminum tin to make a micro little survival kit. I just said we're not doing survival, didn't I? But fire starting kit and stuff like that. Um, let's see, we have a little, a little battery and you can micro USB charge the battery right in there. Comes with the wire. So you can't charge it from the external, but you can just, you know, plug the battery right in to charge it. I'm going to have to intercut. Uh, obviously, we're not going to test this out out here in the bright light, but we'll, we'll test that out inside and then I'll, I'll cut into it, into the footage here. Always nice to have a nice little pocket sized light. Another one anyway. Let's go, what is this? Um, corrosion inhibitor, designed to protect your everyday carry from the elements. It's food safe, which is awesome. So I could use this, for example, on, um, uh, what am I thinking, my uh, uh, Damascus kitchen knives and stuff like that. Um, spray on, rub in, wipe off. So, you could use it on a host of knives, especially your carbon D2 type knives that we see all the time now. Cool. An ounce for $5. Not bad. I'll have to test that out and do another another test on that later on. 1x4 Technicians Pocket Screwdriver for $4.95. What do we have here? Oh, nice. So we've got a double-sided Phillips head. And then I'm guessing this is what? Slot? Yep. And based on these sizes, I'm sure that you can uh, replace these. You know, if you had, maybe you wanted to do Torx or something, you could switch this up for five bucks. Not bad. Not bad. Cool stuff in this box this month. But now here we are, the Eye of Ra. D2 stone wash and satin finish. Best Tech makes some cool knives. Whoa. Of course, it's all oily because it's D2. I don't bring anything out here to wash off knife oil with. Look at that. Golden liners. I mean, they're not real gold, but we can pretend. Ooh, that's nice. So once again, you know, this is the value of the whole box right here. Like, and then everything else is just extra. Deep carry clip. Oh, 
Oh, very nice. Very nicely finished. Um, that's a really nice blade. And of course, you know, Eye of Ra, the symbol there. Anytime I hear Ra, I think of Stargate. But um, definitely not going to be push buttoning this light switch flipper all day long, but great action. Nice EDC sized, of course, you know, EDC club. Really nicely finished G10 too. And satiny finish there on the blade. It's got kind of a two tone. I don't know if you can tell right now in this light, but you've got like uh, sort of a uh, tumble finish on the flats and there's not much of the flats there, but it's there. And then on the swedge and the actual grind, uh, you've got, you know, the satin finish. Really kind of interesting looking. You can sort of, I mean, intentionally, there's a little bit of the liner showing uh, around the edges of the G10, and it's very cool looking. But Best Tech makes Best Tech makes some really cool, really nice knives. Here's a little slicey, very clean cut, and a little pull through. Nice snap on it, very clean, and then push right through and slice. Yeah. Of course, it being D2, we can use our corrosion inhibitor. This is a cool thing to have. Use our corrosion inhibitor right on it, so. Weight feels like it's, you know, just a bit much for a knife this size, but it's not too bad. Uh, yeah. Awesome blade. Awesome blade. I'm really, I'm really enjoying the EDC Club since I started it. It's, it's a very cool subscription. Again, switching from all this tactical type stuff and survival type stuff to just simple EDC gear. It's it's awesome. Um, I was not sure how I was going to feel knowing the family line it comes from, but you know what? Has not disappointed me yet. Seriously, it is not. Um, and the stuff that's coming in 99% of the time, it's just cool, useful stuff. Very cool, useful stuff. So, yeah. Um, I really enjoy it. I know somebody has wanted to give me uh, spoilers as to what has come in it, and I was like, no, no, but uh, yeah, I, I think it's, I definitely think it's worth the value, honestly. It's, it's a cool subscription. So what do you guys think? Um, what do you, what are you thinking about this month, especially? I, I don't know, every, every month I think I said like, well, this might be the best month yet. But this month might be the best month yet that I've seen from them. Um, there's just cool st I mean, they source cool stuff to put in here. Definitely, definitely this month, especially looking forward to hearing your thoughts on what comes in this box, this envelope anyway. And as always, big shout out to my Patreon team who is very instrumental. I, you know, I don't always say specifically, this is, this is thanks to the Patreon team. This is not whatever, but um, in general, very grateful to the Patreon guys because you never know if, if what you're seeing is directly out of my pocket due to their support, whatever. But thanks to the Patreon team for all the stuff they make possible. Thanks to all of you guys for watching this channel and helping me build it up and keep it going. And remember that you are all absolutely awesome. I appreciate every single one of you, and I will be back again real soon.